like that. Like so much fun last night. Party. Yeah. 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 And you, you crazy. Paris Hilton, round two. Are you serious? Hey, where's my coffee? Where's my coffee? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Can you take this away? Can you take this away? Thank you. 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 Ha ha ha. Anyway, what is it? I'm a horrible. What is this? Ew. Hey, we're on air, Jimmy. We're on air. Oh. Oh. Hi there, America. <laughs> okay, this is Gilman Studios, um, Channel Alpha News, recording live. And um, in a recent study, statisticians have done a report using the Chi-Square test with data that will shock you. Yes. So in this study, the statisticians, genius statisticians, randomly selected 50 students and 50 staff members of the John W. North 2008 graduating class and asked them what their best high school memory is. Yes. Best high school memory is. So when they collected the memories, which was really hard I hear, trying to get everyone's memories, tracking them down across campus. Yes, very difficult. They filled out a piece of paper and wrote down their memory. And the statisticians, in a very genius-like manner, put them into categories and compared the results between the two to see if the results. Mm, what is what I'm looking for? Were similar. Yes. Anyway, so, reporting from the past now, reporting from the past now, interesting, thank God we have a time machine. <laughs> reporting from the past now, we have Mustafa, Mustafa Hamoudi mm -hmm. outside right now with Mr. Emmett. Oh man, did you say, hey yo, hey yo girl, hey yo girl, hey yo, let me get those digits, come on, come on now, I'm on TV. Mo Moose, we're literally, we're literally on TV right now. Hey, Jimmy, back in the studio. This is Moose, Moose Bahamudi. I'm here with the time machine. And we are about to go back in time to reveal Mr. Emmett's favorite memory in the past. And this is a juicy one, guys. It involves a girl and a trip to Europe, so we'll see what happens. Caution, what the heck? Mr. Emmett, and the side effects from the time machine made him Asian <laughs> and a rice picker, but we'll see what happens. All right, we found him. Stay quiet, stay low. Oh, who's this walking into the picture? Is this Sarah? His long lost love? Is it? Send the secret camera in there so they can't see us. Send it in. Let's go. Mr. Emmett, you've always been my best friend, so I wanted you to know. That I'm leaving to Europe. I leave on a midnight flight. To Europe? We're best friends. Oh my god, what? You couldn't tell me this before? What happened to. Sorry. We're gonna move to Montana. I'm sorry. Montana. We're gonna have a farm. What? Are you, are you kidding me? And why do you call me Mr. Emmett? That's weird. That, oh my. Oh my god. Mr. Emmett, that was just a, a drunken night. I'm, I'm sorry. Dr I have to leave. What? I have to go. Drunken night? Drunken night? What? I have to go. Where I'm are you sorry. Go Oh my god! Why? Why? Sarah! 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 Oh my god, it looks like Mr. Emmett is leaving. We have to go follow him. Come on, follow me. Can I zoom in there? I think he's leaving. You going to Europe? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You know why I'm going to Europe? Why are you going to Europe? 
because I loved her. All right, Mr. Emmett just jumped in this car and it looks like he's going to Europe. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Dude. Man, these smells, these flowers smell so good. But anyway, back to Jimmy Vong at the studio. Oh, thanks, Moose. You have anything you want to say, Christy? Oh, um, yeah. Actually, there's breaking news that's just coming into the studio right now. Apparently, the statisticians have run into some errors. We'll go to Emily right now for her details. Yes, Christy. I'm here with Stanley McStatterson, and he's going to reveal the problems that the statisticians ran into during the survey. So what were these problems? Well, guys, in any experiment, it is important to survey many people. And this experiment only surveyed a total of 100 teachers, 50 students, and 50 staff members. And there's a variable called the embarrassment factor. This embarrassment factor is, let's say, a teacher didn't want to reveal his favorite memory was a substance abuse problem. At the same time, he may write graduation because he doesn't want to reveal that memory. Uh, let me go over my uh, notes here. Well, ladies and gentlemen, next time the statisticians should block the teachers according to the school they graduated from, and they should ask a broader range of students, such as sophomores, juniors, freshmen, and seniors, to see an overall memory outcome. By the way, you were really, really beautiful. And here, over to you. Yeah, what he said. Well, now for our commercial break, and when we return, your sports report. excited for our son to get his driver's license. Woohoo! Oh, here he comes. Nice. Nice. I did it! I got my license! <laughs> <laughs> I got it! Woohoo! I remember. Dun 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 dun! Dun, 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 dun. Now we're back at Gilman Studios. Now to Emily for her sports report. Thanks, Christy. And I'm here live at the John W. North Championship Football Game After Party, where the Huskies have won <laughs> their second CIF game. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. <laughs> In a matter of two years. All right, girl. Pretty face. Oh, Wait, you know, I found something. something. Could this possibly be the 1976 CIF Championship Game trophy that Mr. Brunig won? This is an item that the John W. North Huskies will cherish forever. Back to you, Christy. Thanks, Emily. That must have been an amazing artifact to find. Now to you, Jimmy. It really must have been. But to wrap us up tonight, the, the statistician's findings are concluded here. Based on the chi-squared test, they concluded that the, that the best high school memory is not related to whether, staff, whether they are staffers or students. Since <clears throat> the calculated chi-squared is <clears throat> greater than 12.59, the null hypothesis was not rejected. There was not enough evidence to conclude that the best high school memory is related to whether they are staffers or students. Anyway, so signing off for Gilman Studios Channel Alpha, you have Jimmy Vong and Christy Wilcox. Thank you and be safe. A millionaire, I'm a young money millionaire Tougher than Nigerian hair My criteria compared to your career just isn't fair I'm a vanilla